Hey what's up guys this is Sandeep Sky and in this video I'm going to show you how to install Fedora 38 on a virtual box so without wasting any more time let's get started so first of all open your web browser and go to the official site of virtual box to download virtual box so you can download it for your system and after you have downloaded virtual box you can install it like a normal program and once you have done that go to the official website of Fedora and download the latest version of Fedora workstation so after you have done the both steps close your web browser and you need to open VirtualBox so once the VirtualBox is open you need to click on new to create a new virtual machine now give your virtual machine a name I'm going to give it Fedora and for the virtual machine folder choose the local disk where you have a lot of space and for the ISO image just select the ISO image which we downloaded earlier now click on next now you need to give at least 40% uh, of your RAM so if you have a 8 GB RAM you can give 4 GB of RAM and if you have a 4 GB of RAM then you can give 2 GB of RAM and it is better to give at least 2 cores for your Fedora and you can also check this enable EFI next now for the virtual hard disk I recommend you to give at least 20 GB because you may run out of space if you give less space for the virtual machine now click on finish now before starting click on settings go to system go to processor and make sure to enable this option and go to display and make sure to max out the video memory and if you want you can also enable shared folders so for example I want to share my D drive and I'm also going to check this auto mount option so that's it click on OK now you can start the virtual machine by clicking on the start button So finally we are in the welcome screen of Fedora installation so you can just click on install Fedora so here we are on the installation wizard of Fedora so you can just select your language and now for the installation destination click on it and select the virtual hard disk which we just created earlier and for the storage configuration select automatic and click on done now click on begin installation and it will start installing Fedora so this will take some time so I'm just going to fast forward this part so finally the installation is complete now you can click on finish installation and you can just restart your virtual machine
enable third party repositories So that's it for the setup. We have successfully installed Fedora on VirtualBox. Now if you want to use shared clipboard and shared storage, you need to install the VirtualBox guest edition. So you can just go to devices and select insert guest edition CD image. So that's it for the video guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this video helpful and if you did please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.